we, we're behind a mission now, uh, how you can help yeah. organizations mm -hmm. such as where. Yeah. So we met, let's uh, go with that. We met at the mayor's office, mm -hmm. and you were standing there. I got there a little bit er earlier, and it was uh, Dino Newville Day. And yeah. everybody's like, who's Dino Newville, right? Yeah, yeah, right, right. <laughs> but share a little bit um, what, you know, really, you came there. You, you're part of the gym, but you became part of it. I became part of it, and all of a sudden, we, we meet up at the, at the mayor's office, and we're supporting a mission at Blue's Gym. All right, so probably six months ago, I'd have been like that too. Who the hell is Dino Newville, right? So, <laughs> uh, but long story short, yeah, I met D uh, like Dino has a gym in Kentwood. I grew up in Kentwood, and I was looking for. I saw his gym on TV, okay. and I saw him and uh, was there it uh, Floyd Mayweather Senior okay. on TV, and he was presenting Dino with a check and. It's kind of listened to the, I kind of stopped what I was doing. I was kind of listening to it because I knew it was this gym in Kentwood. And I'd half been looking, I'd half been looking for like a boxing gym for my son. Oh, you have? Okay. I had been half kind of, uh, okay. I, I want to offer this. I want, I want them to do what I think is good training for hockey. And I that's think what the gym is. Tell yes, me what yeah, yeah, is. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, uh, and so Dino's getting this gym, uh, money from Floyd Sr. about keeping his gym open. So I kind of said, oh, it's in Kentwood. So I was out running errands one day and I was kind of like, you know what, I'm going to go find this gym. And I knew right where it was because there's a little area. I used to ride my bike in this area. Like, I knew this area inside and out. That's okay. where I grew up as a kid, riding my bike and stuff. So I knew exactly where it was. So I popped in there one day, and I don't know. I don't even remember a conversation. I was just kind of like, well, you know, I'm kind of checking out your gym. I was, you know, I have two young boys that play a lot of hockey and like to mix up their training a little bit. And, you know, what do you have here? You know, are you sparring or what are you doing? Do you have class or whatever? And, and you could tell, you know, the, I mean, his nose is sideways. And he's got a punched in look like he's got, you know, you can tell he's, well, he's a four time. You can tell he's been around the block. You can tell he's been around the block a few times yeah. and, uh, and it got a little bit of bite to him, which I like too. I was like, you're a little bit, uh, I, I, I like, it's like a guy you wouldn't want to meet in an alley. You know what I mean? Like, like he's, he's, or if you're, going, if you're in the alley, you want this guy on your side. You actually, you do not that you don't want to meet him. You want him on your side. If you're going down a dark alley, you, he's a guy that you want on your side. So, and he, <laughs> So just talking to him, and I kind of introduced myself, and he, he wasn't a big hockey guy at all, and I kind of explained a little bit about my background and this and that, and then he was like, okay, and I said, well, I grew up in Kentwood, too. He's like, you did, you know, blah, blah, and so we got to talking. We chatted for 15, 20 minutes, and said, I'm going to bring my boys back here. So this is probably last August or something like that. Okay. So, so I then I brought my boys in there to train, and it was very good, and then they went off to their seasons, and I thought it was really good, and so, um, you know, and Dino would put them through the paces, just some general sparring, just to get them used to throwing punches. I just thought it was great training. They'd come out of there. It was hot in there. It was August. It was hot, and they came out of there, like, like drenched. Like, and, they, and the boys liked it. They thought it was really fun, you know? Okay. And yeah. what kid doesn't like to hit things, you well, know? Right? They love to get it. Yeah, they love yeah. to get it. So, you know, just staying in contact with Dino and learning more about his gym and um, the effort he's trying to put forth there in Kentwood and help kids, like, give them a place to go after school instead of just kind of milling about their houses or playing video games and doing that, like they can kind of have a place to go and actually get something out of the day, get a little exercise in, get out of get the house. A, yeah, get some and for some of them, they yeah. don't actually don't even have a whole lot of places to go. Right. You know, let alone that. Maybe a safe place where they can sit down and do their work if they have to, school books, or mm -hmm. do their school work a little bit, uh, where they can give them a quiet area and maybe, you know, might, maybe some snacks to eat and stuff like that. Just and being around people, something yeah, positive. Yeah, and just kind yeah. of kind of be observed, be supervised and know that somebody's there, kind of there for them and give them a safe place a to go. Yeah, yeah. yeah.